Gaming. Hello and welcome back to Pokeroo Gregazar Gaming. I am Pokeroo. And I'm, sorry and, I'm you, and I'm sorry if you can't hear us very much. The Abzu is, is very... Uh, I'm just going to start it so that maybe the song will quiet down. But yes, this is a game about being a, a, a life-giving robot. Very visually beautiful. This is pretty awesome. Uh, it was an indie game and I think it cost me on Steam a couple bucks. But I've, I've had my eye on it for a while. Exclusively to play on the channel. Damn. Dude, I'm loving this. I'm, I'm loving it already. Right. <laughs> that's, like that's, a a cool, that's the cool thing about, like, the, you know, the, you know, exploring the ocean. It's just like exploring space. Well, we haven't even explored it all, eh? Like, that, uh, right. that rift right, in right. the middle of the ocean is so deep the, that it's just, like, unable to... Yeah, you're talking about the Marianas Trench? Yeah. Yeah. Isn't there Deepest a, point in the ocean. Isn't there a band called the Marianas Trench? No, but there is a band called uh, August Burns Red who has a song called uh, the Marianas Trench. Can you <laughs> sing it? Uh, <clears throat> I can't sing it, I can scream it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is it really, like, screaming? Oh yeah, it's like it's blowing your water, it's gripping around your throat, that kind of thing. Wow. Yeah. But like, I love that shit. Like, they're like, I don't really care what like what uh what background a band comes from. Like, if they're a Christian metal band, if they're like you know, like a a techno slash metal band, like. If A, they got good lyrics, B, they got good melodies, C, they got, like, a good beat behind it, like, I'm all about that shit. Like, I, I, I just want to listen to good music. I, I want to listen to, like, stuff I've heard over and over again, kind of thing, you know? That's kind of why, that's kind of why I started, you know, writing my own music as a musician, because I'm like, I don't want to listen to anybody else, because their music sucks. So should, I just want to uh, listen to my own music. get into that again. Well, I mean, that's that's why I'm kind of waiting for, um, like, our channel to get bigger so that I can, you know, I can actually write an intro and an outro to our videos and, and have it be, like, catchy and entertaining. Well, not even that, but, I, you know, you could also, you know, just write stuff anyway, you know, just for your own sanity, you know? Well, that, that, uh, that's actually why I was doing it in the beginning. And um, got to the point where... <laughs> My fucking, my fucking dad was like, "Hey, why are you even doing this? No one's gonna hear it. Are you even showing anybody any of this? Where, who would like this?" I'm like, "A, my friends. B, uh, fuck you if you don't like it. Shit." So, I guess so. I mean, I guess. But, in, but that's in this that case. was the thing. Like, like my, I was working at McDonald's and my friends were like, showing me like 8-bit music, like you know, chip tune, like video game, you know, retro video game sounding music, like, you know, Mega Man and Super Mario and shit, and I'm like, Super Mario. I can do that. Super Mario. And they were like, you can't do that, right, Greg? And I'm like, uh, I could totally do that. And they challenged me, they are like, you can't do that. And they're like, I'll give, they're like, we'll give you until, you know, the next time we hang out. And, and, and that'll be, that'll be, uh, you know, your little challenge. And I did. I wrote, like, Two or three songs, you know, all in eight bit, while I was, you know, doing doing a little freestyle rapping, and they're they're like totally blown away. They're like, "Are you? Were you just hiding the fact that you could do this from us?" I'm like, "No." And they're like, "Why didn't you do this? Why didn't you like make this music before?" I'm like, "I guess I was. Well, I wasn't ever challenged to. And maybe that was the reason. Maybe that was the reason I I got into, you know." writing, you know, retro chiptune 8 Well, I, I always knew place. you were challenged. <laughs> oh. Yeah? Oh, you're so funny. Let's talk about <laughs> it more. <laughs> talk about it. <laughs> fucking Rob brought that up the other day. He fucking didn't really. Like, he's, like, <laughs> he's like, yeah, I, uh, I don't know if I would want to talk about it. I'm glad that that's a thing. <laughs> I'm glad that we're making that a thing. I, because it's, I don't know why. I don't so, want to give like, it any. Deafening. I don't want to give it any more respect than it, <laughs> like, than it actually <laughs> deserves. 
<laughs> but it was it was just so retarded at the time. I'm just like, oh my god, did you really just say talk about it? And yeah. you're like, yep. <laughs> Deal with it. <laughs> I think what you said was the low hanging fruit. <laughs> yeah, like I'm. Yeah, I'm glad you grabbed for the low hanging fruit on the fucking comedy tree. <laughs> And the oh you got oh oh I thought you were gonna lose consciousness for a little bit I thought this was like some product. no no I'm a robot oh yeah I'm a robot so you don't breathe that air yeah no I don't I don't got nothing <laughs> oh shit like I was about to be like dude you need to go up for air dude you're gonna die no 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 but you're this, a robot so it doesn't no, matter this is at Subnautica <laughs> no I know man like I'm uh, looking at it looks like it. So it's I, not I, the same though. So I played Subnautica. How I, do you like it? Oh, do you think man. it's too hard? Do you think it's like too much of like? Well, I'm playing on like the to... freedom mode where you don't have to worry about uh, drinking or uh, or food. Oh, okay. You know, and I'm just trying to figure out the controls and stuff like that. <clears throat> yeah. Like, like clearly I need a a repair tool, but I can't find like I and I've gone pretty far out there. Oh, you need a uh, you need a uh, crash fish powder. Oh, exactly. I've been grabbing fish <clears throat> everywhere, and I got a scanner. And well, like... if you watched if you watched one of my videos, you would know <laughs> that if you just go, it's funny. A little it's true. It's actually true. I, if I paid attention, if you did to your videos, if you did, you'd, you'd know where you know you'd know what to do. Um, but yeah, no, it, so far it's okay. It's just... You know, I like that I could put those, like, chests just in the habitat or whatever. Oh, you don't want to do that. <laughs> Why? You, you don't, uh, you're talking about the, f the floating locker? Yeah. Yeah, last time I tried that, it erased all my uh, stuff that I put in there. It did that once, and I was like, why? It's so yeah. weird. You know, but if you make a if you make a base and then you put a locker inside the base, all that shit's fine. For some reason, I don't know. Yeah, well, I'll get there, man. I'm just... It's cool. Like it's it's totally exploratory. Like you don't know what's what you do don't know what this? anything is, you know. And you just kind of explore you, and go, oh, what's this? this? I like it. Like it's pretty. It, it, it's very pretty. I'm gonna get on the uh, flap flaps. Flap flaps. <laughs> the dirty flap flap. Isn't that pretty? And it, like everything has its own physics. Uh, by the way, the reason why this is so beautiful is because it's on the Un Unreal 4 engine. Oh wow. So this is what games are going to look like, at least indie developer games. Like this level of like care. Oh. Yeah. Is it going to have the same frame rate too? Oh, I, it, for you, is it bad? It's not terrible, but it's like... You, you just <clears> remember, <throat> you're getting a lagged version of the game because we're, sh we're screen sharing. To me, it's like it's, perfect. Okay. But you're, 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 uh, you're getting a, a slightly different version than me. Oh, uh, that might make sense. Yeah, that might make sense. Yeah. Because it, it's pretty clear for me. It's... Oh, oh, that's... oh, shit! Dude, fucking Jaws came out of nowhere and was like, fuck your little robot. I'm gonna go check out oh, the, the depths of the ocean. Dude, what? <laughs> that always that always scares me in Subnautica. Like, I'm always scared to go to the bottom of, bottom of the ocean. It's always shit. Oh, you never Whoa, go dude, to... turtles! Yeah, exactly. Toidles. I like toidles. Ter what turtle? I see you're dressed up as a zombie. What? What do you think about the fair? I like turtles. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All I, love, right, I love that stuff because it's, it, it's like so stupid. Like, and it's funny because he wasn't it's even just meaning to. Like, you can't. You can't predict it. You can't predict what people are gonna say. Kids are like that, right? Or yeah. like the the fucker brain and the pussy thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But that's. But that. But that came from an adult, and now every kid and adult is saying that every time they get on. The news. It's like, wow. What do you think about this guy uh, riding his bike during a snowstorm? I don't know. I mean, he he must have his reasons. But all I all I want to say is just fuck her right in the pussy. Because <laughs> uh, it's because good, good for you. So this is the antagonist of the game. Not not this specifically, but this uh, 
Oh, shit. There's an AI in the middle of like a bigger ocean that I'm going towards that uh -huh. uh, is uh, is bad and is like affecting the the, the ocean poorly. <laughs> so I have to turn on the it. turn on the oxygen valve. I can't <laughs> let you do that. I can't let you do that, Dave. <laughs> I uh. Wow, we're old. <laughs> yeah. Look it up. Stanley Kubrick's um, 2001 Space Odyssey. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure it holds up very well today. Oh, sure not. Ah. <laughs> Ooh, now I'm in like a current. Oh, oh, this is like uh, in uh, Finding Nemo when when they when they join the current. Yeah, but I also get boosted by these. Specials. Oh shit, dude. Oh, this is what, it's actually, and the music here is really nice. It's like, uh, it sort of reminds me of, like, Babar music. Babar? <laughs> you remember Babar? The, the little elephant? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, I guess was it king? I'm sure it had to do with, like, African politics and shit like that, <laughs> yeah. but... But it was, about. but it was clearly, like, hey, he's a little elephant. Isn't he cute? But everyone, you know, on the outside that wasn't, you know, a king to watch a children's show was just like, why does he have, like, an African accent? Why is he a prince? It's like, <laughs> yeah, it's oh, like, cause, you know, I mean, because, because royalty. Because I, I am the king of Wakanda. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the king of Wakanda. <laughs> Who am I with the dolphin? It's like Echo the Dolphin. I guess these are like krill. Oh, those are fish, dude. <laughs> those are Swedish fish. They're just like swimming around with Swedish fish right now. Gummy bears. Something, something here and there. Gummy bears. Oh, there's a shark. Have you ever swam in the ocean? Yes. Well, uh, how, did, how did it go? Uh, one second, I can barely hear you. This is not a bitch. Oh my god! Oh, look at the dolphin. I, I went to Myrtle Beach in, uh, in, uh, south, uh, um, South Carolina. Oh. And it was okay. Oh, cool. Alright. Uh, and I also went to Cuba. 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 I went to Cuba. Um, and it was pretty cool. Are you gonna meditate? <laughs> A robot has to meditate. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, it's like a the robot safe, meditating. I guess. Or like a safe. It's pretty cool. Oh like yeah, that. no, I uh I, I swam and it was very, very scary. Are you seeing sharks? No, but it's just that that's always on my mind now. Hmm. Are you afraid of sharks the same way that most people are afraid of snakes? They go into the forest. Expecting snakes? No, I. I guess yeah. I, I. I guess I just understand that. Like they like to hang out where people would swim. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, like, I well, just know that like they exist in the place I. Well, I mean, like that's the other thing. Like some people who get. I don't understand it, but I mean, like I kind of understand. It, but, I don't think I would have the same mentality if, like, I got attacked by a shark and I would, you know, I'd just be like, well, this is their habitat. I'm in their <laughs> world. They're like, you almost died. Don't you have any, like, like, uh, like animosity or, like, hate or vengeance towards the thing that almost killed you? They're like, no, I was in the wrong. I, I was just surfing. They're like, yeah, because you're on top of the fucking food chain. Like, on Earth. 
but as soon as you get in the water, guess who's on top of the fucking food chain, dude? Not you. <laughs> dude, get all, the, get all the Swedish fish. Isn't that funny? Like, you have sharks. Oh, killer whales. Oh, wow. I've heard some stories about killer whales. Like, the wild ones. Like, they attack boats. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> like sea bro. Well, yeah, they do it kind of unprovoked. They do it just because they're killer whales or orcas. Oh, one second, sorry. It's just it's really loud. The game, in-game, is really loud. Can you, can you not, like, just mute it or turn it down? Or? No. These are my <laughs> options. Chapters, meditate and change the camera. Are you shitting my fuck? <laughs> so give it one second. It's just going through its like weird loud part while it's doing this like moving it's like you're It's like you're achieving transcendence. Woo! <laughs> Free Willy! Oh there you see now it's a little quieter. Um yeah, so no, I, I suppose if I were in the ocean, you know, I would accept that the ocean is a place of things that will kill you. Because you're not from there, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, you're not, you're not adapted to it. You, you, you can wear a dive suit, you can have flippers, you can have an oxygen tank, but that's only going to get you so far like that that doesn't give you more you know a better uh what do they call it perceptional awareness where you can just sense things around you like sharks can they can sense a drop of blood in miles of mile square miles of water if sharks could you go can. on land they would probably be the dominant species yeah <laughs> they probably would <laughs> isn't that fucking terrifying uh, well, it's but it should be only terrifying in the thought of fear, you know. Yeah. Oh, dude, black hole. I know. This is actually we're we're releasing the big animals into the universe. See if we look over. Why? If we look over there, we already did the flap flaps. So there's this one. There's another one that goes over there. There's another one behind us, and then there's a fourth one. So I think this might be a three-parter series. So what, you gotta like this you gotta like discover these animals and swim with them and, and then you unlock them or something like that? Yes. Wow. I actually I actually kinda nailed it. Well, it's it's like you're you're bringing them back to the ocean. It's like a world where like things have gone awry. Oh, oh okay. And you're you're bringing back those things back to the world. And you're Best doing case. it by Love, you see here, I, I, I reach into myself, and I bring up the love. I am Chappie. <laughs> <laughs> I love that movie. <laughs> see, now it's Killer Whales. Oh, cool. It's the shrine of the Killer Whales. This weirdly reminds me of Zelda. It's probably because it's got a bunch of light around it. Oh wow. It's like water underneath the water. <laughs> it's like uh, SpongeBob SquarePants, where they're drinking stuff, <laughs> but they're in yeah. water. Dude, I think those are barracudas. Ooh, barracuda. <laughs> Look at this dory fish. Grab onto this killer whale, ride him. <laughs> this feels like this feels like Katamari Devasi, but with like like with like fucking marine life. <laughs> it weirdly reminds me of like a Namco game, like all this color and all the music, like it. Yeah. All the all the uh, like pressure put on music. Well, now you're definitely in the water temple. <laughs> 
Oh, look at this. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, you can see the... You can see the, 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 the swordfish trying to, like, like, go through the school of fish. That, wow. It's pretty fucking cool. Look at this. Alright, so that's true. I, I'm actually kind of liking this. Uh, yeah, I'm liking it. I find it very relaxing. You know, like, it just has that feel. Yeah. Strange controls though, I gotta tell you. Was it like kind of inverted or something? Or? No, it's like, uh, like boat controls. Oh, okay. The blue whale. How do you know it's a blue whale? It could be a humpback whale. Oh, and there's a whale shark. Uh, I don't think that's a whale shark. I think that's another type, I think that's another type of shark. No, whale sharks are the ones not... that are like whales. Uh, yeah, but I think you might be wrong. <laughs> yeah. I bet you're right. I know it, what it, I want, I want it now. I know have, you, I have you ever seen uh, a Greenland shark? No. A Greenland shark is probably the most terrifying shark that lives uh, today. It lives in Greenland. It lives basically on the bottom of the ocean, in the coldest ocean, coldest temperatures. It it has like microscopic teeth, and it's bigger than a great white shark, but it only eats like really small like like krill and stuff like that. But it, it can open its mouth to like this like gigantic like diameter and you're just like oh my god I hope that thing doesn't eat me and then you realize that it doesn't eat people still pretty scary though well there's a whale maybe that's what a whale shark is just called because it's it, well, a whale, a whale it, shark has like white spots on it let's go see where the fuck is that thing where are you? This feels like sub, this feels like subnautica but cheating because you have no hair <laughs> it does feel like that a bit. There he is. He's down there. Oh, that is a basking shark, dude. That is a basking shark. Look at its its mouth is all the way open, dude. That is a basking shark. Yeah, I guess so. Whoa. Look at that fucking thing! It's for, That's it's, fucking terrifying! It's for, it's for catching krill, right? Yeah! But that's how big it is. It's as big as a great white shark. Doesn't eat, you know, stuff a, a great white shark would eat. But it's as big as it, so it's intimidating. You know what I mean? No. Oh. I wouldn't. I would. I still wouldn't want to go anywhere. Blue whales or humpback whales there, I guess. And then there's a meditating spot. By the way, I'll show you Looks what like the meditating spots do. Press the back button, it does this, and then it just. I can switch between all the different types of fish. Oh. Sweet. So that's the gray reef shark. The Maui Maui. The Maui Maui. I'm terribly interested in that. What's this? Maui Maui. Oh, that, that was like a reef tip shark. Yeah, no, it's it's swapping between them all, but it's being strange about it. Yeah. Oh, because I'm... Okay. You're like Professor X with a fucking animal life. <laughs> Seriously, fucking ocean. Though, right? I'm trying Show to find... Show me Nightcrawler. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, did I tell you I went and seen the Logan movie? Oh, did you? Yeah. What'd you think? What'd you think? I think it was pretty good. Yeah. I mean, like, it, it was like, uh, do you remember the one where he loses his powers? The yeah, I, I didn't I didn't watch too much of it, but, yeah. It's canon. Yeah, it's pretty Apparently. Canon. Yeah, I can see that. He loses, the uh, guy, Japanese warlord guy, uh, gives him a serum, uh, tells him it can cure him, 
of his, you know, his powers, he lies and says, basically, you know, basically it can cure your powers, but it, what it really does is just get rid of his healing ability. So that's when they try to kill him and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. I guess I just saw a, a swordfish eat a fish because I got an achievement for it. Oh, shit. Yeah. Dude, I never understood the difference between marlins and sailfish and swordfish. They're all different, apparently. I guess so. But yeah, so that's uh, that's this episode, I think. Dude, you're just sitting on a shark head. Yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. Shark head. So what do you think? You like it? I like it. Like I'm waiting to see the point where like you get eaten by a great white shark. Well, no, I'm not a human. I'm a robot. And like uh, this is apparently a, a species of robot people who take care of the oceans and like all the animal life accepts it. Oh, cool. Yeah. So th there is no antagonist in this in this game, other than the uh, uh, the diamond things. But the uh, diamond things. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> so, it, it, so it's 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 kind of like the game Ark, where there's like dinosaurs and prehistoric creatures, but you're not helping them in Ark, and there's like all these like tech, you know, like you know, extreme technological shit that's in the background, and you're just like, what the fuck does that do? And you have to just explore it. And, yeah, for sure. And that's that's part of the game is just exploring the world, which I love that. Yeah, it's just a pretty exploration like crazy fish swarm game yeah look, dude look at the fish donut <laughs> fuck <laughs> anyways that's, that's uh, what we're calling I, guess we, I guess we know what this is going to be called fish donut fish donut <laughs> anyways uh, we'll talk to you guys later and uh, please check out more of the series and uh, like yeah. comment and subscribe on Pokeru and Gregazard Gaming on YouTube and check me out on Twitch um usually between 3 to 6 p.m. most days except for Wednesdays and Fridays. Yeah, and uh, you can find him at uh, uh, twitch.tv forward slash Gregazard. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, well, that's it. Bye, guys. See ya.